These are the top five laptops with the best battery life. Let's mention who you won't find here. Apple, Dell, HP, and even everyone's favorite, Toshiba. Try to contain your sadness, Toshiba fans. Let's get to it. At number five is the Samsung Notebook 9 Pro. In our battery tests, it survived 12 and a half hours. That means you could watch around 34 episodes of Friends at an average of 22 minutes per episode back to back before the Notebook Pro would quit on you. At 2.8 pounds, this is one seriously light laptop. It's also a two-in-one, which means you can bend that screen all the way back to use the laptop as a tablet. The Notebook 9 Pro works with a Samsung stylus. The downside is there's no place to store the stylus in the notebook. If you're looking for a unique design, well, I'm sorry. In his review, CNET editor Josh Goldman said it feels like a laptop designed by questionnaire and lacking any sort of personality. He's kind of way with words. Coming in at number four is the LG Gram 14 2-in-1. It beat the Samsung Notebook 9 Pro by a whopping 300 seconds. Its battery life was 12 hours and 35 minutes. That means you could watch 68% of the Ken Burns documentary Baseball before the LG Gram 14 had enough. Let's talk specs. This thing weighs just 2.5 pounds and has a 14 inch display. LG managed to cram in full sized USB-A ports and an HDMI port. Imagine that, a thin and light device where you may not be relegated to traveling with dongles. The LG Gram 14 also has pen support, but like the Samsung Notebook 9 Pro, there is nowhere in the laptop to store it. Number three is the sixth gen Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Carbon. You could watch the Godfather trilogy, Goodfellas, and Reservoir Dogs with 11 minutes to spare on battery life. In non-movie terms, that is 13 hours, seven minutes. This ThinkPad X1 Carbon is not a two-in-one. It's a one-in-one, it's just a laptop. If you like privacy, you're in for a treat. This thing has a physical shutter for the webcam. So if you're worried about people watching you watching crime movies, they should not be able to through the webcam. You'll also find Amazon Alexa on the ThinkPad X1 Carbon. Number two is the Asus Nova Go at 13 hours and 12 minutes. That is equivalent to the Alien Saga from the original to Alien Covenant with over an hour left to research all of the plot holes. Okay, I'll admit it. I have never heard of the Nova Go before today. This laptop is using a Qualcomm Snapdragon 835 instead of an Intel chip. As it is a mobile processor, it handles battery life like a champ. Additionally, the Nova Go has instant on capabilities. It wakes up and gets ready to work in a flash. You know, I forgot to mention the price. It's around 700 bucks for six gigs of memory and 128 gigs of storage. So what's the downside? While it does run Windows 10, we did run into issues, particularly with games that could not run on the Qualcomm chip. At number one is the LG Gram 15 with a battery life of 13 hours and 58 minutes. You could watch every Avengers movie and still have over three and a half hours left to use the laptop. Let's talk about specs. It's made out of nanocarbon magnesium, which keeps its weight at two and a half pounds. It packs a huge 15.6 inch display in a small package. The screen is a bit bouncy when you touch it though. The Gram 15 also has USB-A ports and a full-sized HDMI port. This one's going to cost you though, two grand, but you get a large screen and great battery life in a very light package. If you were looking for a Mac with the best battery life, that would be the 15-inch MacBook Pro. I'm Ayaz Zaktar and I'll see you online.